and John Rodgers is still his player. Hi, Judy. What's up, B. Davis? I'm just getting these updated right now. What's up, guys? I'm just getting this TikTok posted. Then we're gonna go over everything that's kind of going on. And we go right away. Who was in the live earlier? Who was in the live earlier when I went live? Let me know if you were in the live earlier. What's up, Maria? I'm gonna go over these. Um, I'm just posting everything. On Instagram, Facebook, I'm about to go live now. Me, what? Yeah, Ducky, what's up, man? Welcome back. You're the one that told me my sound was okay, so I really appreciate that. It's probably easier if we do it like that. So I'm just turning on a live for TikTok right now. Probably Instagram. Well, probably TikTok first because TikTok 2K to me. Oh, guys, it's been a long day. It's been a really long day. But thank you guys for showing up. You guys are the real MVPs. So yeah, let me make sure you guys can see. Okay. Now this is when it gets crazy when we start letting these TikTok animals in here. This one starts getting really crazy with these TikTok animals. These TikTok. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I love them. I love everybody. So just posted that. All right, you guys ready for the TikTok? You got should we let the should we let the TikTok uh the TikTok people in? There's currently 770. You guys actually see this? You can see how many people's online. It says 775,000. So that means probably maybe like a thousand people's gonna join or something like that. YouTube, <laughs> it's cold blooded, man. It's cold blooded, Ducky. Um, but you guys get the first, and you always, you guys always get the last. I'm probably gonna be live today for that one, just because I was live earlier, and I've been like, uh, all of this gotta eat too. So I'm gonna just do this real quick. You two shoppers. <laughs> you guys are so cool. You guys are so cool. Make sure they get make sure they guys can see you. Alright, so now we're like, we're allowing you two to come in. I'll make sure they see the screen too. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And that way I can see what I have to see. We have YouTube going. All right. Cool, 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 cool. cool. Um, I only joined the YouTube channel. I joined the YouTube because better quality. Yeah. Plus, I can answer a lot more questions on YouTube. Uh, you know what would be cool? <laughs> yeah. So let me just go live on Instagram. And then, yeah, probably not going to do Facebook. Probably don't have time for Facebook. So, yeah. So what's up, Instagram, real quick? <sighs> We're going to go over uh, Biden's plan. So it looks like it's going to include $1,400 stimulus checks. So it looks like it's going to include $1,400 stimulus checks. And this is per adult, including college dependents. Okay. So it's per adult, including college dependents. 
It also is extending unemployment benefits till September 30th at, at $400 per week. Also, we're looking at eviction protection. So we're looking at eviction protection um, till September 30th. Um, also, mortgage forbearance until September 30th. SNAP benefits to stay at a 15% increase till September 30th. And then also looking at a $3,600 child tax credit for kids age five and younger. Also, a $3,000 child tax credit for kids age 60, 17. We're also looking at grants to small businesses. And one of Biden's key things is to keep essential, essential uh, frontline workers on the job. So that's kind of one of it's been one of his key things. Uh, these are so these are pretty much the key elements of in Joe Biden's new stimulus plan, which he announced today. So let me know in the in the comment section. Let me know in the comment section if you were on the live earlier when we watched this live together. So yes, say, yeah, do I was there or right, say no that if you weren't there, if you were not. We're currently streaming live on Instagram. We're live on TikTok. We're live on YouTube. Have not pulled up the Facebook because Facebook's kind of itchy. Yep. Yeah. So that's kind of what's what, what what's the plan of what we've gotten so far. Um there was unfortunately there was no mention of student loans. So we have not heard anything about the student loans. So unfortunately, there was no mention of that. Hopefully that comes soon. Hopefully they're still talking about it. I know a lot of you guys were waiting to hear that and I hated to be the person to be like, oh my God, I didn't hear about it. But I was definitely like up in there like trying to see what they're going to be talking about. So unfortunately, there was no mention of that. Also, guys, um, just a real quick, you know, throw a little ad out there. If you need help with any type of your taxes, you need help with your bookkeeping. You need help getting your QuickBooks cleaned up. You're going to want to use the link in my bio. It says hire me. Make sure you pull out that application in full. If you want help, if you have questions, make sure you pull out that application in full and check that, yes, I need help at the bottom. Uh, so I'm going to uh, – this this live will be probably a quick live. Um, yep. So Ingrid was there. What's up, Ingrid? Uh, Amber was there. Justice was there. Blessed wife. And no, yes, thank you. Look at Ducky with the live. This will be a probably quick short live, guys. Um, so let's start with Instagram. So when will we find out and everything's passed? So that's a great question. So we're not going to find out anything anytime soon. So as the days continue to go by, we'll, we will probably start to hear more information. So this is kind of like the like the the introduction. So think of this this plan as a book, and now we're reading the table of contents. So what's going to happen next is unknown. What is known is that Joe Biden, Vice President Harris, uh, they get sworn into office on Wednesday. So I'm pretty sure in Wednesday, a lot they can start taking a lot more action. Um, yeah. If you have not received your second stimulus check by the time you file your 2020 tax return, you're going to want to claim the recovery rebates credits uh, when you file that tax return. Also, guys, if you want like instant updates, like as soon as what I find out, you're going to want to follow me on Twitter, Twitter and Instagram, especially Twitter. My Twitter and Instagram is at Duke Loves Taxes. Only if you want instant updates. If you're fine with just watching the videos on TikTok, I usually post a video on TikTok around right before, like either a couple minutes before I go live or right before I go live. So if you're okay with just daily videos, you know, you can follow me on TikTok, but if you would like instant updates of when I find out, you're going to want to follow me on Twitter and Instagram at Duke Loves Taxes. Okay. Oh, yeah. And so there was a mention of the, I forgot to put that in the video. Um, there was a mention of uh, minimum wage as well. So there's there, there has been no time, right? There's been no time when these are going to come out. This is just the plan that's just going out. So this is just the plan. So we first heard about the plan. That's what we know of right now. This is just the plan about what the deadline is, about what's going to go on. We don't know. So for everyone who's just joining, I'm going to do a quick update. So today, Biden announced his stimulus plan. So this is the day that we have been waiting for with all our little things, right? So this is what's included. Okay, $1,400 stimulus checks per adult, including... Adult and college dependents. 
Okay, so that's the first thing. Extended unemployment benefits till September 30th at $400 per week. Eviction protection till September 30th. Mortgage forbearance until September 30th. SNAP to stay at a 15 15% increase till September 30th. $3,600 child tax credit for kids age 5 and younger. $3,000 child tax credit for kids age 6, between 6 to 17. Grants for small businesses. And to keep essential frontline workers on the job. Everything that I just mentioned, everything that I, I just read um, um, are the key elements that Joe Biden and Joe Biden's new stimulus, okay? So everything that I just read are kind of like those key elements. The name of this plan is called the American Rescue Plan. Um, unfortunately, there was no mention. Unfortunately, there was no mention of student loans. So um, hopefully that's still in the talk. It's been talked about for a while. So hopefully that's something that can come up very soon as well. Um does that mean we don't get any more for child dependence? Yes. It, um, so this one would increase the child dependence. Um, what does child... So when you file your tax return, you typically get a refundable um, tax credit if you have children. And so pretty much if you have children now, and if your children is age six... And, well, not now. This is the plan. This hasn't been passed yet. Okay, so this has to be passed yet. Remember, guys, for something to pass, it has to pass in the House, in the Senate first. This is just what the president is, well, the president soon to be, um, is talking about what's going to happen, okay? So in order for this to pass, remember this. Let me see here. Let me, let me, let me go live on um, um, Facebook. Let me see your pins because this is what's really important. In order for something to actually pass, it has to pass in the House, in the Senate. Just because a president or a president-elect is saying, I want this done, does not mean it's going to happen. In order for it to happen, it has to pass in the House and it has to pass in the Senate. The reason why... Biden is so confident that this is going to pass is because he got everybody on his side, pretty much. So here's how it works. You have the you have Congress, right? You have the House and the Senate, okay? So the House is blue, okay? So in order for something to pass, red and blue got to get together, okay? So the House is blue, the Senate is blue, okay? So the House is blue, the Senate is blue. The White House is blue. Okay? So that's why Joe Biden is so confident that it's, it's going to pass. So that's why he's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because he feels like everybody's on his side. So that's what we're kind of looking at right now. So there's no timeline about when this is going to come out or when this is going to happen. This is just the plan that came out. Also, guys, if you're going to need help with your taxes this year, you're going to need help with your bookkeeping or to clean up your books, you're going to want to fill out the form on my website. You can find that form by going to the link in my bio and clicking Hire Me. Fill out that form, and when you get to the bottom, make sure you say yes. Um, yeah, it looks like I did freeze on TikTok. Mm, not sure why. Um, I wonder if it says I'm frozen on TikTok and I wonder how I'm frozen. Like, what's my post? Okay, now I, it's, just, it's just, it should say I'd be, y'all thought I was frozen, right? You thought I was frozen. Look, I really tricked y'all. I said, <laughs> I got you, I got you, I got you, I got you, right? I'm, I uh, yeah, got you again. Thought I was frozen. Okay, guys. <laughs> here's what I was. Here's what I. <laughs> like, 
Tapi tinggal. <laughs> oh, I thought I was frozen again. Whew. That one I had to help my breath there. <laughs> thought I was frozen again. I got you again. Guys, right before I was, um, you thought I was frozen. Okay, actually, I'm, I actually did freeze again on TikTok. Um, I need to stop playing around before these people actually think I'm frozen. Um, focus. Yeah, I do got to focus. Um, focus. Right. You're right. I got to focus. I don't know why my the TikTok is actually freezing up. Yeah. But, um, yeah, because I had to get this out of the way. Focus, too, but this is silly. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Okay, so oh my god, chill. TikTok is really yeah, TikTok really did freeze again. I'm seeing this. I don't know why TikTok's freezing. Hi there, I missed the news. Yeah, I'll go over. <laughs> oh, you're stuck on TikTok. <laughs> okay, guys, I'm gonna go over re- a recap again. It says I'm frozen. Okay, guys, I'm gonna go over re- recap again. I don't know why it literally says I'm frozen on TikTok, but I do not want that. So hopefully. I don't know literally what's going on. Um, so here's what, what Biden's plan was released. <laughs> um, it's going to be $1,400 stimulus checks. So I'm just going to do a, a quick recap. Okay. $1,400 stimulus checks per adult, including adult and college dependents. Um, extended unemployment benefits. Sorry. Extended unemployment, um, extended unemployment benefits till September 30th at $400 per week. Eviction protection till September 30th, mortgage forbearance until September 30th, SNAP to stay at a 15%, 15% increase till September 30th, $3,600 child tax credit for kids aged five and younger, <laughs> $3,000 child tax credit for age six and 17, grants to small businesses, and to keep essential frontline workers on the job. That's kind of like, these are kind of the key elements of what's been going on in Joe Biden's new stimulus plan, which was announced today. Um, yeah, so looks like my, the TikTok's actually frozen, so I'm really trying to get that uh, fit. So that's kind of the key key elements about what the plan, okay, I'm focusing, um, about what's going to be announced today. Okay, so hop over here from TikTok. Hi, welcome from YouTube. Um, welcome to YouTube. Uh, if someone owes back child support, would they get the fourteen hundred? Hopefully, yeah, because I was in. The, but we haven't seen the full package of about what's going to be released yet. Uh, well, people are still waiting for the six hundred from Jackson Hewitt miss uh, on the fourteen hundred. So not sure yet because that fourteen hundred is still being talked about right now. Um, you foes at <laughs> okay, guys. Thank you guys for everybody who stuck around. Um, while TikTok was frozen, I will do. Um, uh, I will do another. I'm going to do another recap for TikTok because they were actually frozen while I was joking around, and I need to focus. Okay, so uh, $1,400, a $1,400 stimulus check per adult, including adult and college dependents. Um. Extended unemployment benefits till September 30th at $400 per week. Eviction protection till September 30th. Mortgage forbearance until September 30th. SNAP to stay at a 15 points. Why do I keep saying 15? Okay, so self employment tax is 15.3%. So now every time I see 15%, I just want to say, okay. Focus. Snap to stay at a 15 point. I almost did it again. Focus. Snap to stay at a 15% increase till September 30th. $3,600 child tax credit for kids aged five and younger. $3,000 child tax credit for kids aged 16 to 17. A child tax credit. It's a credit you file. It's a credit you claim when you file your 2020 tax return. It is a refundable tax credit. Currently, if you have a child 
the child tax credit is at $2,000 per child. It's $2,000 per child. So if you owe the IRS $0, you should receive a $2,000, a $2,000 um, child tax credit. Okay, it's a $2,000 child tax credit. So it increases your refund. A child tax credit, a credit, if you owe no taxes, a child tax credit will increase the amount of your refund. So if you're used to getting a large refund by claiming children when you file your tax return, we'll expect it to go up if Biden plan passes. So what I just read, $3,600 child tax credit for kids age five and younger. So with the Biden's new tax plan, if you, if you have a child that's age five and younger and you're used to getting a refund, expect to see an additional, an additional $1,600 on top of that. So he's trying to increase your refund. If you have a child that's aged between age six and 17, expect to see an additional $1,000 when you file your um, 2021 tax return. So this will be a credit in 2021. That's kind of what he's talking about. Also, what he also mentioned is grants to small businesses. So this is, once again, it's this is different from the PPP and the idol, the one that everyone's going crazy about right now. This is a little bit different from that. So a grant, just talking about just straight grants, not a loan. This is free money to you. So that's also what's been mentioned. And one of his key things is to keep essential frontline workers on the job. So what I just spoke about are the key elements in Joe Biden's new stimulus plan, which was announced today, Thursday, January 14th. Unfortunately, there was no mention of student loans. Guys, the reason why I am following this extremely closely is because I have to. I own a tax practice where I handle business owners and individuals, uh, bookkeeping, prepare tax returns, and we do tax planning. Tax season is coming up. If any of you guys are watching this, know you're going to need help with your taxes, with your bookkeeping, or any of that. If you want to just get that in order, you're going to want to fill out the form on my website. So go to the link in my bio, click hire me, fill out that form. Now, if I'm not able to get to you, someone else can. So make sure if you say, yes, I need help now, there's a box at the bottom. Make sure you select, yes, I need help now. Do that if you want your taxes taken care of, of this upcoming season. So do that immediately. I will look at that. Okay. Uh, so now I'm going to answer some questions. We start from the bottom of the top. We file our taxes prior to the new child tax credit passing to tax law. Will we get the remainder if it passes? No, no. So no guidance has been released yet. Uh, oh, we got some people on Facebook. What's up, Facebook? Um... Uh, if I haven't received a stimulus check, but not sure if it was mailed out to an incorrect address, what should you do? So if you if you have not received your stimulus check by the time you file your 2020 tax return, you're going to want to claim the recovery rebates credit when you file that tax return, okay? So that's the credit that you're going to claim when you file that tax return. Now, I, ha I have a video on YouTube explaining you, explaining how you can claim it yourself, but if you are afraid, like, you know, you just rather have someone else do it and make sure it's done right, make sure you fill out the link in my bio. Go, or go to my website, it's Duke Tax Online. Go to contact, fill out that form. When you get to the bottom, make sure you said, yes, I need help now. Um, and also, guys, what I forgot to mention, in, what I forgot to mention in my video is that there was, um, he also mentioned uh, minimum wage going to $15 an hour. So that's another thing that was mentioned as well. Um, just tune in. Are we getting a $2,000 stimulus check? So it's been talked about. It's kind of in the plan right now. Um, and it, this was just announced like a couple, like probably an hour ago, like a little over an hour ago. Um, what should you love, friend? Uh, when should they vote the past? No, soon. So yeah, this is all great questions. So there's no official date about when it's going to be passed. Because if it was, I would have told you to do this. Also, we have 153 people watching on YouTube. Great job. That's awesome. But there's only 53 likes. I want to know if how fast we can turn these likes. It's 54 likes. 
How fast can we get it to 100? By the time I look back over here, I want to see the likes at 100. How fast can we get the YouTube likes to 100? Right now, it's at 66. Oh, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. It is currently at 90. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, we were so close. Okay, should we put 10 more seconds on the board? 10, 9, 8, 7. <laughs> there we go. All right, we got 100 likes on YouTube. So it was just at like 50. So thank you to everybody who just like, was that kind of like, <laughs> did, did, did I put the pressure on? I didn't mean to put the pressure on. <laughs> I put the pressure on YouTube. Focus, focus. Okay, what's up, TikTok? Hello, hi. Hello, uh, focus. Thank you for telling me to focus. Strawberry Gang, what's up? Uh, yeah, what about child dependence? So it looks like they're going to be, uh, they're going to child dependence as well. Can I get my check if I just turned 18 in December? Absolutely. Absolutely. Oh, Sam, we got some questions on Instagram. And, okay, so we got, here's our first question. Our first question is answer my question. Okay. Awesome. Answer that. Um... Is it four hundred dollars plus what you already got in unemployment? So it's going to be four. So the unemployment, um, the unemployment is an is, is just an additional. It's going to be it's going to it's going to go from three hundred dollars to four hundred dollars. Okay. So the unemployment in in Biden's plan is supposed to go from three hundred dollars, from three hundred dollars to four hundred dollars. Um, should we wait to file our taxes? Yeah. So. If you haven't received your stimulus check, I would hold off on filing your taxes just for a little bit longer. Because here's the thing. And if you, let's say, you know, you check the status of your stimulus check. You log into the portal and it says, well, we mailed out your stimulus check on January 6th. Okay, let's say we mailed out your, well, unfortunately, and I hate it has to be like this. I really do. But unfortunately, those checks take up anywhere up to three to four weeks to mail out. And I know, I know, I know that's the last thing you want to hear. You want your money now. It's my money and I want it now. I know, I know. And I totally get that. But it's just, these are just guidance from the IRS. Now, some people have received their check within a week. But if that three to four weeks have not passed from that day and they said, hey, we know to check out on this day. You just count for at least four weeks, four weeks in a day. Just give it four weeks in a day. If, it, it's, if it's four weeks in a day, if you have not received your stimulus check, you're going to want to go ahead and file your 2020 tax return and make sure you claim the recovery rebate credit when you file that. Now, if you're using a software like, I believe, Jackson Hewitt, uh, Jackson Hewitt, uh, and I forgot I, I forgot the other one. I, I believe it was dropping the score. And if you guys know the other one, let me know on YouTube. Um, but at least Jackson Hewitt said they're, they're sitting at the stimulus checks on February 1st. And I know that's, uh, I know you guys don't want to hear that as well, but I'm just relaying the information. So uh, what's up? Uh, um, Instagram. Um, Student loan forgiveness. So unfortunately, there was no mention of the student loan forgiveness. Um, thank you for coming on live again today. You are very loyal to us. <sighs> that's that. That's that. That's that. Sh I love when you guys say thank you. Thank you, guys. You're welcome. And thank you for you guys. YouTube kind of popping today. We got 158. What's up? So, guys, who's ready for a recap? Do the recap. Do the recap. Do the recap. <clears throat> I'm, I'm pretending I'm putting a cap on. Do the recap. Do the recap. Recap in the two case thing. Recap in the two case thing. Do the recap two case thing. Okay, focus, focus. <laughs> so let's do a recap, guys. Okay, so fourteen hundred dollars stimulus checks per adult, including adult and college dependents. Extended unemployment benefits till September 30th at $400 per week. This is not an additional $400, right? So if you're already receiving set $300, it's not an additional. It's going to increase it from the, the amount that it is right now, which is um, $300. It's just going to increase it in just a little bit, just $100 a week. Okay? So it's going to be $400 per week. Um, 
Eviction protection till September 30th. All right, so if you guys worried about getting evicted, that this is in the plan. Uh, that protection until September 30th. Mortgage for bit mortgage forbearance until September 30th. Snap to stay at a 15 point. Dang it, I did it again. I was trying really, really hard that time not to say this. Every time I see 15 percent, I want to say 15.3 percent. Okay. Sorry, but I was trying so hard. Snap to stay at a 15% increase to September 30th. And then also a $3,600 child tax credit for kids age five and younger. A $3,000 child tax credit for kids between the ages of six and 17. The current child tax credit is at $2,000. What a child tax credit generally does is increases the amount of your refund. So if you have a child that's under the age of five and this plan passes, and this plan passes at law, you will see an additional $1,600 as a tax refund. So if you get a $5,000 tax refund, if this plan passes, you will receive a $6,600 tax refund. Also, if your child is between the age of 6 and 17 and this plan passes as law, if you're generally used to getting a tax refund, you will receive an additional $1,000 as a tax refund. So if you typically get a $2,000 tax refund, you will receive a $3,000 tax refund if this plan passes as law. In order for this plan to pass as law, it must be passed by Congress. In order for it to be passed by Congress, it must pass in the House of Representatives, and it must pass in the Senate. So the House of Representatives are, are is what makes up Congress. Okay, the House and the so it's the House of Representatives, Senate, Senators. The House of Representatives and the Senate make up Congress. Okay, so the House. Okay. The house itself can either be blue or red, okay? So currently, the house is blue. The Senate can either be blue or red. Currently, the Senate is blue, okay? So the house is blue, the Senate is blue, and our next president is blue, Okay, so you have the president. The president is the one that says, I want these laws and I want them now. In order for these laws to happen, it must pass in the House and the Senate. The House and Senate are now blue. So this is why the, our next president is saying, hey, this is what's going to happen because we're in control of the House and Senate. So that that, that is why there's so much confidence when um, Joe Biden speaks like this about these stimulus checks, even though they have not passed as law. That is why. And what I just mentioned are the key elements of Joe Biden's new stimulus plan, which was just announced less than two hours ago. Unfortunately, there was no mention of student loans. And guys, the reason why I am following this so closely is because I have a tax firm myself where we prepare taxes, where we do tax planning, QuickBooks cleanup, cash flow management, and CFO work. If you know you're going to need help with any of that, or you know you're going to need help this tax season, you're going to want to leave this live. You can come right back. I'm probably not going anywhere. Go to the link in my bio. Click, fill out that quick <laughs> fill out that quick application and when you get to the bottom make sure you say yes i need help now if you say no no way jose you probably might not hear a message back but go ahead and fill out that form on my website go to the link in my bio it says hire me fill that out and say yes i need help now okay so yeah Anything for dependents? What's up, Zara? Welcome back. Anything for dependents in new package? Yes, yeah, so it looks like the uh, $1,400 stimulus checks can qualify for adult and college dependents. Uh, not, nothing about housing pay, 
hopefully that's coming soon. I know that's been talking about a lot. Look at that. I love that. Um, I love that. Um, PUA, PUA, uh, unemployment, TurboTax. Um, you're gonna so if you're unemployment you're in the PUA. You're going to want to check with your state. Okay, you're you're, you're going to want to check with your state. Um. Oh, we got 12 questions. Is this, so is this official? So I hope, I hopefully I just answered the question. So this is, this is just a plan. It's not official yet until it get it, it gets passed as law. Okay. So this is just like, Hey, this is what I want. This is what I want. This one won't get this. This is what I want. This is what I want, right? So this is just what's being talked about, about what's being want. In order for this to pass, in order for these four, you, you to see these four $1,400 stimulus check, it's going to have to be passed as a law, okay? So in order for it to be passed by law, it has to be passed by Congress. Um, how much do you charge for a QuickBooks cleanup? That depends. I mean, if, it, it quit, okay, here's the thing. QuickBooks cleanups are not cheap. They're fairly, it, it's quite an investment. So just know that it's quite an investment. If you're going to need help with that, you, you, you know, you're going to want to fill out the uh, form on website and let me know and just, hey, I need help with QuickBooks. And we'll um, set up a time to chat. That was a good question. Um... So is it fourteen hundred dollars? Yeah, so it's fourteen hundred dollars instead of the um. It's, yeah, it's four, so it's fourteen hundred dollars instead of the two thousand. Uh, Congress crying over here. Uh, no, they still have to vote on it and wait for it to get passed. Yeah, exactly. Dusty, what's up, Dusty? Get it done, Congress. Dusty's an old uh high school, middle school, and elementary school friend. So hi, Dusty. What's up, bro? Uh, Katie, can someone um, tell me what is it? that's a child tax credit? Um, uh, Katie, Ottawa Tax is currently working on my 2019. I received first check, but the status of the second check says unavailable. One more receive second check. If you have not received the second check by the time you file your 2020 testament, you're going to want to claim the recovery rebates credit. Um, seriously, come to your lives every day to get information. Thank you so much, Rebecca. Welcome back. Anything for small businesses. Hopefully, there's supposed to be some grants coming out soon. What up, TikTok? And then I'm gonna hop over here to Instagram. Um, wait, wait, what did that say? Can you go over the filing part again? I might have missed it. Filing for exactly what? Recap. Uh, so it looks like it's going to be fourteen hundred dollars for the payment. So the, the official guidance have not been recently released out. <clears throat> have been released out yet. So we're still waiting on that. Uh, guys, you're going to have if you want your a question answered, you want to have to make. I would advise you guys to make it pop. I I look I look for these emojis. Did you say that emoji? That's my emoji. And then also, if you use the secret emoji, there is one secret emoji. That pops out to me. Um, so Duke, uh oh, look at my. Oh, okay, can, are we allowed to answer your question? Um, effective when twenty twenty, not with twenty twenty thousand. I doubt that. Um, but that was a great question. So Duke, when I file for my son and I claim the recovery rebate credit and I get the eleven hundred dollars, well, I also get the fourteen hundred dollars stimulus check plus the. the mm -mm. So this hasn't been passed yet, mommy. My, Mikey, Mikey, my fight. I'm, I'm just gonna call you Mikey. I hope I'm saying that right. This hasn't been passed yet. This is just a plan. This is just talk. This talk. Well, I'll let you know when it passed. So make sure you guys are following to keep that uh, updated. Oh, look, look at that. Um, fourteen dollars in um, fourteen hundred dollars in addition to six hundred dollars we already received. Yes, fourteen hundred dollars to an addition of what you guys have already received. Anything for small. Look how that like. There's certain so those comments like pop out. Anything with small business, thank you. Uh, so in the plan, they were just talking about grants. 
Um, so if we were waiting on our stimulus from Jackson Hillis, should we wait? Yeah, wait till after February 1st, because that's when they said they're supposed to be sending it out. Uh, how about non-adult dependents? So a non-adult dependent would be a child dependent, um, and they should qualify, without a doubt. Um, when do we get the back pay for unemployment? I believe there's no back pay. What's up, Kay? Will we get stimulus money for dependents? Yes. Um, yeah. I saw and I saw federal loan forgiveness. I did not hear anything for the federal loan forgiveness. Uh, will 17 year olds get the money? Uh, so with the new plan, that's what that's what they've been talking about. Nobody from Instagram knows what strawberry means. <laughs> Oh my god. Nobody from Instagram. <laughs> I remember one time I was like, hey, you want to know the strawberry story? And they were like, no, don't tell the strawberry story. It's a secret. Uh, can you answer my question? What's the question? Whoa, look at that candle, guys. I I look at the heart. I have never I have never seen that candle. I have never seen the candle. That was so cool. All right. Um, cool. Um, do I tend families get full child tax credit or do mixed families? Uh, it's going gonna, it's gonna to be mixed families. So at least one has to have a social security. So guys, an I tend, a, a mixed dad's family is where one is a U.S. citizen and the other spouse is not. They're, they're mixed, right? Mixed doesn't mean you're black and white. Mixed just means that's, that's what mixed means for the purpose of this child tax credit. Uh, Do you do credit fits? No, I do not, but my colleague does. So, my, so if you need help with your credit, send me a message with that. I don't do it myself, but I know an excellent person that I do. Um, can you apply for PPE? Yes, with 2020 income. Thank you. Thank you for saying thank you, Kaylee. That's what the heck I'm talking about. Woo! That's what I like. That's what I like. Okay. Okay, so guys, I'm going to do a quick uh, recap, okay? So I'm going to do a quick recap about what's going on. Then we'll go ahead and wrap up this live for tonight. So $1,400 stimulus checks per adult. Whoa, a cake. Dang. I'm hungry, too. I almost ate that cake. $1,400 stimulus checks per adult including adults and college dependents. Um, extend unemployment benefits till September 30th at $400 per week. Eviction of protection till September 30th. Mortgage forbearance until September 30th. Snap to stay at a 15% increase till September 30th. $3,600 child tax credit for kids age five and younger. $3,000 child tax credit for kids age six to 17. Grants to small businesses and to keep essential frontline workers on the job. These are the key elements in Joe Biden's new stimulus plan, which was announced today. On the, the name of the plan, it's a plan, guys. It's not law. Keep in mind that this is a plan, not law. The name of the plan is called the American Rescue Plan. Unfortunately, there was no mention of student loans. Guys, the reason why I follow this so closely is because I own a tax business myself where we help with tax preparation, tax planning, QuickBooks cleanups, and bookkeeping. If you know you're going to need help with that or assistance with that, you're going to want to fill out the form on my website. So go to the link in my bio. Click the hire me. You finally hire me. Fill out that applica application and make sure you select yes. I need help now. If you select no. I, I, I may not be able to get to you, but if I'm not able to get to you, definitely one of my colleagues can. So make sure you fill out that link in my bio. It says hire me um, and click yes. I need help now. And also, if you find value in these live guys, can you do me a favor? Uh, subscribe to my YouTube. I'm doing my, I'm trying my heart to, to blow that up. Also, if you want instant, 
Listen, I'm talking about fresh out the oven. I'm talking about we bite into it and burn the roof of your mouth. Updates. You're going to want to follow me on Twitter and Instagram, but primarily Twitter. My Twitter is at Duke Loves Taxes. And my Instagram is also at Duke Loves Taxes. So if you want them burn your mouth hot updates, uh, make sure you give me a follow. I am live every day at 8 p.m. Central Time. I go live for you guys. Um, so to answer you guys' question, to remove any stress that you may have about, in your life about, you know, why do I do this? And I do this for you guys. So I will see you guys tomorrow, okay? Thank you guys for joining this live, and I appreciate you guys. I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, Instagram. But the 2K, shame me to bed. 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 I want to post my title on Instagram. Uh, what, what was today's title? Uh, mm. Oh, oh, Biden. <laughs> bye, bye, TikTok. Remember, if you haven't already, subscribe to my YouTube at Do Loves Taxes. Follow me on Twitter if you want those instant fresh out the oven updates at Duke Loves Taxes. And check out the Instagram too at Duke Loves Taxes. If you know you're going to need help uh, this tax season, get in early. Get in before everybody else. And you can do that by going to the link in my bio. Click Hire Me. Make sure you fill out that application. When you get to the bottom, it's like, yes, I need help now. If you select no, uh, you may not, you know, get help, but definitely one of my colleagues will be able to help you. Um, awesome. So yeah, my, my YouTube is at Duke loves taxes. I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye guys. Oh, so we had 25,000. Oh, got to end it on Facebook too. Bye bye Facebook. So on that live, we had 25, this is our live results, 25,000 viewers, we got 165 new followers, we got 44 gifters, and 4,796, and we also got people following us on Twitter, so yay, the Twitter is growing, and then. So right now what I'm just doing is I forgot to add my comments to the last video I posted. So I'm just adding those comments. Okay, what's popping, YouTube? I right. what is up? What is up? Thank you guys for still continuing to stick around. Uh, you guys are awesome. You guys are so cool. And you guys are so cool. So we got some new leads for that. Um, so yeah, so like, oh my gosh, my 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 uh, my computer's about to die. Both of them are actually about to die. So yeah. So what's up, YouTube? What's popping? Brand new whip just hopping. Oh. Right here. You deserve it, Duke. 
happy for you. Thank you so much, Amber. Um, I am so hungry. <laughs> okay, so me and my child. Okay, me and my child's father live together. Can he claim me as a dependent, even if I receive the stimulus check? Me and my child's father live together. Did he claim me as a dependent, even if I receive? Why would you want? Mm, I'm a little bit confused about the situation. I would have to know a little bit more on why you would want to do that. Yeah. I'm just trying to help them out in regards to YouTube. Appreciate that, Monos. And welcome back, Auto Detail. Appreciate that. The, does unemployment automatically get reported to IRS? Yes. So unemployment automatically gets reported to IRS, and it's also going to be reported to you. So you'll receive a form 1099 Gmail. Um, I'm having internet issues. Is there any ways to get an update? Yeah. I got you. I need to order something. Yeah, so the update. Sorry, guys. I have to order this Uber Eats because I am hungry. I have to order some orange chicken. So, yeah. So, the update. So... Damn. They did not take it out to get here. Fourteen hundred dollars stimulus checks per adult, including adult and college dependents. Extended unemployment benefits till September thirtieth at four hundred dollars per week. Eviction protection till September thirtieth. Mortgage forbearance until September thirtieth. Snap to stay at a fifteen percent. Snap to stay at a fifteen percent increase till September thirtieth. Um, $3,600 child tax credit for kids age five and younger. $3,000 tax credit for kids ages six through 17. Grants to small businesses and to keep essential frontline workers on the job. These are the key elements in Joe Biden's new stimulus plan, which he announced today. The name of the plan is called the American Rescue Plan. Unfortunately, there is no mention of students' loans. Yeah. Mm. Let's see, yeah. Michelle, I just wanted to know about adult dependence. Hopefully I just answered that question. Um, yeah, so adult dependence for the 1400 but not, not in the past. The only way an adult dependent can now get a stimulus check is if they file their own 2020 tax return. Uh, and make sure they mark, they cannot be claimed as a dependent. <laughs> What emoji is uh, how much stimulus we getting? So the plan says fourteen hundred dollars. So that's the plan. Uh, it still has to be passed in the law. Uh, sorry, I'm gonna stay at a home. Mom, he works. Um, yeah. So he, I mean, are you, are you guys married? Because you can file a marriage by Johnson. So I'm not gonna sure the, you know, what your situation is. Um, how much do we? So if you if you're curious about that. So you may, you may not be speaking with me, but you'll probably be speaking with one of my colleagues. So I would encourage you, if you, know, if you need help with taxes, um, that you fill out the form on my website, digitaxonline at four slash contact. Um, and more than likely, you'll be speaking with one of my colleagues. They can help you. I'm taxed. I am busy. Um, um, I don't believe that there's been an info on adult dependence yet. Yes, Jayla, majors in Are we getting stimulus money for our non adult dependents? I miss non adult dependents. So, non adult dependents. So, if you're not an adult dependent, are you a child? What is, I'm, I'm just, what does non adult dependent mean? Like, I, I'm just, maybe I don't know what non adult dependent means. 
Uh, question, I live in New York City, and I was told I, you can get unemployment and still be working if you under 500 or four weeks up. So I don't know nothing about New York City. <laughs> so I, I cover what's at the federal level. So you have states, right? You have the state level, and I cover what's at the federal level. Yeah. Um, is the child tax credit on taxes? Is this child tax credit a refund on taxes or my? So the child tax credit is a. Is it, it's gonna be. Is it, excuse me. Yeah, it's a refund type of thing. Uh, what can students write off? Students can write off student loan interest. They can write off education expenses intuition paid to a qualified educational institution uh, and say how much non-adult dependents will receive for this. I have no idea what a non-adult dependent is. I would seriously have to put up. And I keep doing that question. So I better, what's a non-adult dependent? Now my computer's gone, so let me just look at on my phone. So now my, my computer's tripping. Not a good no. Yeah. I'm not sure what a non-adult dependent is. To me, when you say non-adult dependent, it sounds like you're saying a child. It just sounds like you're saying a child dependent. So I'm not 100 percent sure uh, what you mean by that. Um, thank you so much for having the patience to answer our questions. You're absolutely welcome. You're living well. If I don't re if I didn't receive my second check and I claim it on my taxes, is it automatically so it's not gonna be an automatic refund? More than likely, it's going to be a refund. But how, if you owe taxes, then it's just going to offset the amount of taxes you owe. So let's say you owe one thousand dollars in taxes, and you get a six hundred dollar refund credit. Well, we would take one hundred minus six hundred. You now owe four hundred dollars. So that's how that's going to work. Now, let's say you owe zero dollars in taxes, um, then you would receive at, that six hundred dollars as a refund. Um, Maria, are we getting stimulus money for children too? How much? So the plan says fourteen hundred dollars. The official guidance has not been released. Don, Ida, thank you, thank you for saying thank you. Uh, little Miss Wild Thing, Little Miss Wild Thing, what you out there doing? <laughs> okay, thanks. You're absolutely welcome, Archer. Thank you. You are welcome, Philip. What up, Philip? Philip's Philip's pretty cool. Uh, does that mean we should wait to file our taxes till after this gets passed? Um, no, I wouldn't wait to file your taxes after this gets passed. Um, the only reason I would, you would wait to file your taxes is if you have not received your stimulus check and it's supposed to be mailed out or something like that. Um, that's all this. But I would not hold my breath on this one because uh, I have no idea what it's going to pass and how quickly it's going to pass. So what's going to go out? But what's going to be important is that you do keep up with your tax returns. But, you know... It wouldn't be a bad thing to just wait. I don't know. I'm away. I typically don't file my tax returns right away because these things are always changes. Uh, I typically recommend filing your tax returns like after March. Uh, kind of like like March 20th ish. Because like last time, like when this coronavirus thing hit, um, let's say, okay, so last time when this coronavirus hit, let's say you had you filed your taxes. Before I believe I forgot what the date. So it, I'm gonna just say March 15th. If you filed your taxes before March 15th and you had your tax return taken by student loans, well, you didn't get that money back. But if you filed your tax, let's say let's say you had a refund and your entire refund was garnished because you owe student loans. Okay. But let's say you had filed your tax return after March 15th. Those that have filed the tax return after March 15th. They could get the money back that student loans was garnished because of the whole coronavirus thing. So I had a couple of clients that filed before and they weren't able to get that back. So I don't know what's you know what's gonna happen. So if you can wait, just wait. Um, but yeah. 
Um, thank you for everything you do. Thank you for saying thank you, Michelle. I really appreciate that. Um, Katie, by non-adult, I meant children. I figured. I was like, what? I was like, but I kept seeing it. You weren't the only person that said that. I believe at least one other person said that. So I'm like, you know, maybe I'm missing something. And, you know, the last thing I think I am is a know-it-all. That is the last thing I do. So, you know, if, if I have to, like, research, I don't mind, like, stopping researching. So just to make sure, because my main thing is that I'm answering your question correctly. Last thing I want to be like, uh-uh, that ain't no word. And it turns out I, it is. And then I look stupid. So, you know, we all say things that we actually don't mean or we mistakenly say. So, no, 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 it's okay. No need to apologize. We all in this together. Uh, Margarita, what up, Margarita? Do you think this would be something added on a tax turn or would be separate? No idea. Only time will tell. Uh, thank you. You're absolutely welcome, Maria. Eddie, what up, Eddie? What up, Eddie? I do, big fan. Appreciate that, Eddie. Thanks for all the info that you give us. Woohoo! Got to thank you already. Ooh, I'm liking this question so far. But do I have a question? But I do have a question. So, how much is the third stimulus check for how much per qualifying child? So right now it's we're looking at fourteen hundred dollars per in each qualifying child. But that is it's not one hundred percent sure yet till this law gets passed. So right now we're just I would say fourteen hundred dollars. That's what we're looking at. Philip, thanks, dude. Thank you, Philip. Um, you're awesome. Thank you. I tune in almost every night on TikTok. Thank you. The living well. I really appreciate that. Uh, what child to get fourteen hundred dollars? Also, so I didn't actually like read where it says the child. But what I did read was it said a hundred dollars per American per adult. So hopefully, I'm seeing I'm seeing it just. But I think as the the days continue to progress, more information will start to come out. Um, so you said IRS gets information about you if you yeah so. Anytime you, so anytime you receive like a 1099 or you receive a W-2, that's called an information form, okay? So how it goes, let's say, let's say, um, uh, okay, so here's how it works, okay? So let me just make this really simple. Okay, so the IRS wants to know how much you make, so they, they, they don't, okay, let me see, hmm. The IRS wants to collect taxes, okay? The IRS wants to collect taxes. There are tired of people who are required to file a tax return that does not file a tax return. So they made a rule. They said, hey, business owners, you can hire people in... You can deduct what you pay them on your tax return, but you are required to send them an information form at the end of the year. And you're also required to send us, the IRS, an information form at the end of the year. Okay, so think about that. When you receive a W-2 and it says how much you got paid, the business gets to deduct that on their tax return. But in order, in order for them to take that deduction on the tax return, they must also report that to the IRS. So the IRS has this reporting system, right? So they give the IRS uh, your social security number, your name, and the amount that you paid. So now the IRS is waiting for you to file a tax return matching that information. So it's supposed to match Right? So it's the same thing with unemployment. Anytime that you receive an information form with money on there that you've been paid this, the IRS also has that. It's called a matching system. So let's say you fail to file a tax return and report that income. The IRS will simply file a tax return for you. And when this happens, they typically overstate the amount of tax that you, you owe. So yeah, anytime you receive a form, guys, it also goes to the IRS. Let me know if that made sense. Let me know if that made sense. Does that kind of make sense, guys? Let me know. Um, yeah. Sorry, dude. Baby had my phone. I have no idea what's going on. Please recap. Absolutely. Uh, so, uh, so Biden dropped his plan today. It was $1,400 stimulus checks per adult, including adult and child college, college dependents, 
Extended unemployment benefits till September 30th at $400 a week. Eviction protection till September 30th. Mortgage forbearance till, until September 30th. SNAP to stay at a 15% increase till September 30th. Uh, $3,600 child tax credit for kids age five and younger. $3,000 tax credit for kids age six, between six and 17. Grants to small businesses and to keep essential frontline workers on the job. These are the key elements in Joe Biden's new stimulus plan, which was announced today. The name of the plan is called the American Rescue Plan. Unfortunately, there was no mention of student loans. Uh, makes perfect sense. Yes. Okay, cool. Okay, cool. It makes sense. God, you're the bomb dude. Okay, thank you. Okay, I'm glad that makes sense. Uh, <laughs> Katie, you must have been watching the entire time because, yeah, I kept stumbling on that 15%. <laughs> okay, so people are always like, you know, how much are I paying taxes for unemployment? In it? So you unemployment taxes is 15.3%. Okay, so that's how you figure out how much you're going to pay in an unemployment tax. So it's kind of like a formula you do, but the unemployment tax rate is 15.3%. I say that so much that I had no idea when I see 15% that I automatically want to, my brain wants to say 15.3%. Uh, so yeah, I have to like slow it down. Um, yeah, so if I were to receive both stimulus checks, I shouldn't want to file my taxes, but we have, we had, yeah, if you, if you had a baby in 2020, you were entitled to that additional credit. So yeah, you should file a tax, credit, especially if you expect a refund. Uh, thank you so much for doing this. You're absolutely welcome, Katie. Maria, you're the bomb. Thank you. Appreciate that. Ooh, food on the way, and I'm hungry. Thank you so much. You're the best. Thank you so much, Eddie. Katie, important question. Oh, snap. Important. Let's see what you got, Katie. Uh, for this year, 2021, what is stimulus for a child? still go based off 2019 taxes, or do you think that would change as things get passed? We have no idea. That's actually a pretty good question. Um, I have no idea. I'm thinking 2020, like if we were just talking, let's say we're just talking it up, uh, we're at a bar or something, I would say 2020. Um, but yeah, I have no idea. Miss Purpose, yeah. Can I DM you on Insta because I have some person? Oh, the, my Insta DM talking. I'm gonna be honest, they're crazy. Like they're crazy. Um I'm, to be honest, I'm not even sure if I'll see it. I'm really sorry. I really wish I really wish there was a way. I really wish there's a way like people could like ask me questions who had serious questions. And the only way I think I'd ever be able to do that is if I had like some website where people actually had to like pay to ask a question. Um, I don't know, but yeah, that's the only reason I, cause I feel like there's like some people who actually need so many like actual help, but guys, it's like hundreds of messages and like, like every single minute. And it's just like, I don't know. I was thinking about creating something where people could actually pay, um, to ask a question. Cause I believe like if I just say, if it's just free, like it's just, it's just crazy. Um, yeah. Hey, we're going to pay yeah. Dude, SSI report to IRS, yes. I, I wonder why they only uh, let you take out 10% Fed and 5% state. I have no idea. Uh, but should I should I wait or after this plan is passed? Thank you, man. Okay. I would be patient. I wouldn't rush to file your tax returns, guys. I would just vote, right? Don't pass it past, don't follow it past the deadline, of course. But I would just wait. Um, if I didn't plan to file my taxes, how can I get my stimulus? You can file a zero dollar uh, tax burden. Any garnishments? No garnishments on the second stimulus check. Not sure about this third one that's upcoming. Um, what if you file? What if you file to take your unemployment tax out of your employment? Then you should have you receive form ten ninety nine G and it'll let you know how much was withheld. What about TikTok? Because I follow you there. TikTok's crazy. 
Honestly, you should charge. That's what I was thinking. Okay, next part of my question, Ella, I've been told that I, I consult a parent and can claim my son as earned income credit and his father Knox can claim him as a dependent. It's, I'm not 100%. I would, you probably want to work with a tax professional uh, for that question. Um, is there any way you can get, is there any way you can, you can, is there any way you can get if you stimulate, if you just turn eight? Wow. I understand that you need help, Andy. Is there any way you can get if you stimulate if you just turn eight? I, Andy, I understand you need help, but I, I don't understand that question. To be honest with you, uh, dude, that would be great idea. Set up a pay per question or what? The yours? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. So we're gonna get down to fourteen hundred. We're, we're still waiting. We're logging off tomorrow. Thanks, bro. All right, guys, that was great live. Appreciate everyone that's been here. If you haven't already, give a subscribe, give a like, and I will see you guys tomorrow. All right, so we'll continue to cover this, and you guys have a great night. Don't let the big bless bite. See you guys. Bye-bye.